Ah, those distinct sounds of football. It is back. Jacksonville State started fall camp today. Now, as mandated by the NCAA, these first couple of practices will be in helmets and shorts. JSU is getting ready to start season earlier. Preseason practice also becomes earlier. Their first game is a week ahead of most. Head coach John Gross says he likes what he saw on day one. A really good first day. You don't say too much because you're in shorts. You don't play football in shorts. But uh, so it's hard to get really excited about a, you know, a head gear shorts day. But it's not a lot of difference between a shorts day and a, and a full pad day for us. So we really got after it and, uh, you know, had a good physical practice even in shorts. So a lot of good things. I mean, I, I think the energy level was excellent. You know, we just got to continue to do that when we fatigue a little bit with these back-to-back -back practices and stuff. So, uh, but like what I saw, you know, I, I love, I said it all along, I love this football team the way uh, blue collar and the way they go to work and it's a lot of fun to watch in action. Gamecocks have won 24 straight games in the OVC. Three conference titles. They're the heavy favorite to a four-peat this year and make it back to the playoffs. But All-American offensive lineman Justin Lee says there's still a lot they can improve on. In the past few years, uh, I think mental toughness and the little things has been is what's hurt us. Uh, too many flags and things of that nature. So uh, in camp, I'd like to see more focused uh, attention to detail, especially on the offensive side of the ball, not turnovers, jumping offside, holding, things of that nature. And that's a lot of things we can clean up. And I think if we do that, it's going to help us in the long run. JSU will hold 23 more practices leading up to their season opener August 26th against Chattanooga at the Montgomery's Crampton Bowl.